my channel. My hair is a mess today because, well not because, it's a mess today period and we're gonna need to figure this out because I am about to go to an appointment to get my hair trimmed. I am in desperate need of a trim. You can kind of see the shape is, you know, growing out. We've got like some long pieces. My bangs are also like really in my eyes and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna take y'all along with me to get a trim. Y'all will be able to see exactly what I ask for in order to get uh, the trim of this shape, you know? And then of course, we're gonna end this video by doing a wash and go and see how we're looking. So this is the really non-cute before content. And by the end of this video, we should be looking poppin' and fresh. I get a lot of questions on the style, the shape, as to like what the name of the style is. It's not technically, I know for a while we were all like on the diva curl, diva cut thing. And now that diva curl is kind of out, it's like, what, what are the names of these styles? Um, so there's not really a name of this style. If we wanna name it, I guess we could call it the list because this is really my favorite shape and I think I'm gonna maintain this for a while. Um, look at this, like all these like super long <laughs> straggly bits just need to be Snip, snip. But in order to get a really good curly cut, for me personally, I really like to get my hair cut while it's curly, obviously. Y'all know majority of the time I do wear my hair curly, so it just makes sense for me to get my hair cut and shaped while it's curly. Um, ideally, it would have been nice if I could have gone in with a fresh wash so she can really, you know, get more of an accurate cut with how my curls look when they're popping. Not ideal today, because obviously, obviously, we're in need of a wash. Um, I've also been wearing a headband of like this, you know, the one that I normally wear for my workouts and stuff. Working out is my priority, so um, yeah, a little bit of a mess. So I kind of want to go in and refresh some of the curls. That way we can get a really accurate cut. I'm just starting by kind of fluffing it. Let's just add a little bit of mousse. I don't wanna overdo it with mousse, but I just want the curls to be kind of popping how they normally would again so we can get this like accurate cut. Cutting curly hair can just be such a hit or miss because the curls kind of do different things every single time you wash them. All right, I'm also just gonna do a little handful and kind of scrunch the mousse in the back there. Okay, so let's go ahead and diffuse this now. Okay, I think we're basically ready. I'm definitely gonna have to drive like this so I can see. Ew, this looks so bad. This is like a pet peeve of mine. I hate when my bangs split or if there's like a hole. Eh, hate it. <laughs> um, but I think this is good. I am so excited to get this trim. The goal is to keep this fro look going. I want volume, va va boom. I want the roundness. And then also I do wanna keep the length actually. I think I'm enjoying my hair as it's growing out. A lot of you have been asking like, am I gonna keep growing it out? Like what's my plan? So far, I am growing it out I think. I'm enjoying the extra length and then also y'all know that I'm gonna be getting married hopefully by 2024. <laughs> And so I would ideally like to have some extra length for my wedding as well. So for now, we're growing out, but don't hold me to it because you know how I get, you know, but that's just where we're at today. All right, so all that's left for me to do is put on some fragrance. Ooh, Valentino is one of my absolute favorites. Yes, it's the Donna Born in Roma. Mm, so good, I'm gonna just spray that all over. Did I do too much? Okay, y'all. Let's go. Oh. Um, so for me, I just, you know, yeah, touch up these see. bangs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then kind of just a little more yeah. like off the top of layers, but then yeah. coming down a little bit so we can just yeah. have like shorter layers on the top. So it's fluffy. And that's basically it. Just keep it like round, yeah. same kind of shape. It's looking so good. Well, it's yeah, good. It's I love it so much. So it's my favorite shape, I think. I mean, done. yeah. Me it suits too. my face. It's yeah. And, it's, and it just grows yeah. out so good. So good. Like, so quick. <laughs>
amazing. Yay! I love it. I can't wait to watch it tomorrow. I know. <laughs> so good. It does look so good. Okay, y'all. So, Crystal is in the process of building a new salon. So, we're about to go check it out. It's supposed to be so much bigger and beautiful. Is this it right here? It's literally right next door. It's beautiful. I love getting a good trim. Excuse me? With all this volume, I'm really gonna enjoy all this volume for the rest of today. I'm obsessed. It's giving and that new salon is gonna be everything. I think sometime next year. It's literally right next door. Right next door, but it's like three to four times the size and I'm very excited for it. It's gonna be such a vibe. Oh my gosh. This got me feeling so good right now. <laughs> All right, so it's the next day. I have just put my hair back because I went to the gym this morning. Um, by the way, with my hair like out and fluffy yesterday, we ended up going to the mall to get some Christmas shopping done, all that good stuff, and I got so many compliments on my hair. It just goes to show there's nothing like a good shape. I had no curl definition. Well, I had a little bit of curl definition, but it was big, it was fluffy, it was frizzy, it was out there but people just loved it so much. Anyway, so of course today, right now, we're gonna go ahead and wash and style her. I'm really excited. I love like the first wash after a fresh trim. <laughs> so good. I'll definitely be using some of my go-to products. I know we've been doing a lot of hair experiments here and there, trying all different kinds of things, but at least today y'all will get to see a couple of my go-to wash and go products as we go through this. So let's get in there. Okay, literally just from rinsing my hair, I can already feel like how much better my ends feel. They feel so good, like not scraggly or anything, just <sighs> nice and healthy. So for shampoo, we are going in with our favorite, the Way Detox Shampoo. Y'all already know how I feel about this detox shampoo. Bombs.com, it has apple cider vinegar in there, so great for not only cleansing, but balancing the hair and the scalp. Love this stuff. Look at it. You can kind of like see the layers happening here and that's exactly what I wanted. Shorter on top for more volume and then just, ah! oh my God, I'm so excited to see how this dries. So for deep conditioner, we are going in with a Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. I mean the OGs know. This is my absolute favorite protein and moisture like balancing and deep conditioner and it's about time. I typically like to do this at least like once a month to give my hair a little bit of repair and a little bit of protein just to keep it nice and balanced and healthy. So I'm gonna go ahead, leave this in for a few minutes, finish up my body care and then we're getting into styling. I think y'all could probably already guess what we're gonna style with. Yeah, nothing new to see here. Okay, we're styling with the Dew Mousse Def. That's it, simple. Three product, wash and go. We love to see it. All right, this is how we're looking. The curls are super defined, extra juicy. I just love the wash after a good trim. So now we gotta diffuse. the next day it is in the morning I just woke up took a shower I really wanted to give y'all day two results so here we go so this is how we're looking fresh from waking up haven't touched it at all curl definition is popping we have a couple stretched out curls from where I slept on my hair <laughs> obviously the main thing that we need to do today now is to just kind of fluff it up and get some volume going so I'm just gonna grab my holy grail briochio strengthening repair treatment oil and then just add a couple drops to my hands and then we're gonna fluff this bad boy out i really like using my hands the way i would a pick i don't know i just feel like i have more control and i just kind of pick my roots up a little bit okay and then while we're fluffing i'm also just checking to see if there's any little scraggly bits that I may need to trim. I don't want to go too crazy, but I have shears. So I usually just kind of do a little sum sum myself at home. I think this looks good. Oh, 
Y'all, have I ever told you how obsessed I am with this shape? I like this shape, I think I found like my signature kind of go-to shape. Like we're slowly getting more length back here and still having lots of body and volume at the top. I got my bangs here. Like I just, this shape is definitely where I feel the most happy, the most confident and wash days are nice and quick and easy. It's just an all around all around great vibe. So yeah, this is how we're looking. We have shiny defined curls with lots of volume. I just could kiss Crystal for giving me this shape. I just love it. Y'all are in the Atlanta area. 12 out of 10 recommend you check her out at Salon Scanda. Really excited to see the new salon come together in the new year and everything. Yeah, guys, that is basically gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I will catch y'all tomorrow right back here, same time, same place for another day of listeners. Bye.